Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to do unseen theorem, which is in front of you. This take question is taken from circle. In the given figure, if O is the center, you can see here O is the center of a circle and AB is a diameter which is passing from center. And DO is perpendicular to AB. DO is perpendicular to AB. It means this angle is 90 degree. A, B O D or A O D both are 90 and after that we have to prove that A E C A E C this angle we have to prove equal to O D A O D A these two angles we have to prove equal so let's take a start you can see here first of all we have to write on given what is given here O is the center of a circle so we have to write on O is the center of circle and AB is diameter of circle AEB or of circle you can write on also what is given here also both two lines are perpendicular each other OD or DO perpendicular to a B after this to prove what we have to prove here to prove we have to prove this one so we have to write here angle A E C is equal to angle O D A these two angles we have to prove this angle A E C and A D O or O D A both are same these two angles we have to prove equal construction we have to draw one line here construction join BC so we have to join here BC let's join BC you can see here this two points we have to join after this here we have to write on statement and here we have to write on reason just we have to follow the rules of circle and we have to prove two lines uh, two angles are equal so in number one first of all we, i'm going to take two triangles here in triangle look at properly here in triangle a c b and triangle a d o look at properly here in diagram a c b this triangle and a d o a d o this triangle you can see here um, we have to show here three things first of all properly look at here being a right angle this angle and this angle is 90 degree you can see here a o d if this one is 90 then this also 90 yes a o d in this triangle and here 90 a b c this 90 both are 90 degree so in number one we can write here angle a c b is equal to angle a o d and the reason we have to write to get proper properly here a c b a c b this angle and a o d this angle both are right angle so we have to write here both are right angle so here we have to write both are right angle after this you can see here this angle for for this triangle this angle and for this triangle also this angle this angle is common for both the triangles so in number two we have to write angle b a c is equal to angle d a o d a o look at properly here b a c b a c in this triangle a b c this angle and in this triangle this angle in a d o in this triangle this angle o a d or d a o both are same so this one is common angle so we have to write here common angle if two angles are equal definitely third one itself it will be equal so what what is the what is remaining angle here this angle and in this angle this angle both are remaining so we can write here in any triangle two angles are equal then third one itself equal so we can write here angle o d a is equal to angle a b c and in number three we can write here remaining angles in the triangle remaining angle itself it will be 
equal if two angles are equal in number two now after three statement what we think these two triangles are congruent after congruent what we have to write down corresponding sides or corresponding angles also equal so in number two we can write angle a e c is equal to angle a b c so here we can write here angles of circumference standing on the same arc or same base you can write anything you can see here a e c a e c this angle and this angle this means a b c both angles are equal what is the reason because they are standing on a same arc a c so both the inscribed angle are equal or angle at a circumference or inscribed angle both are equal and we know that this angle and this angle are equal you can see here a b c a b c and o d a o d a these two angles are equal these two also equal it means this and this it will be this and this equal so in number three we can write therefore angle a e c which is equal to angle o d a from where we have to write from statement one number three and two i will show you here look at here properly this a b c and a b c both are equal it means r h s equal means l h s also equal so a e c which is here o d a which is here and what we have to prove a e c is equal to o d a we got here proved if you understand please hit the like button